Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, this is Mamadou again. I just wanted to share a quick video uh, before the major event of the day, which is the Pacquiao fight um, today. I want to talk about the um, back way route to Europe. Um, it took me a while to make a video about this um, issue because I, like many of you, have been um, guilty um, of um, helping um, a brother um, you know, take this route. Uh, my case is that um, obviously the phone call started coming in the middle of the night of a brother stranded in some way in Niger um, needing help. Like many of you, I was torn um, in between either helping a loved one or having to stick with what I believe in. But um, I did cave in and I was able to um, assist um, him. And um, um, he was eventually able to make it to Libya. Um, the rest of the story, I'll just keep it to that. Um, but. Ever since then, I thought, you know, what could I have done different um, in the sense that um, to stop, what could I have done to stop him from taking that route? And um, at the end of the day, it's just information. I believe that it's the lack of information that is why most of our brothers and sisters are taking this route with the understanding that, um, you know, they, they are also caught up in, in a situation where they do have to, um, you know, make a living. Um, back home, there, there are no jobs. The youth is sitting there. And... Uh, you know, grown to age where they have to um, start providing for their families and they can't, and that pressure is pushing them. But also our responsibility is to let them know the dangers that are involved in this route, that um, it's not worth to uh, risk their lives. Um, you know, the information needs to be out there as much as possible, and I challenge all of you, uh, let's keep talking to them, let's not give up. Um, we understand uh, it's a very difficult conversation. How do you tell a young man um, to not go and um, struggle uh, when we're sitting out here, obviously making a good living and um, you know doing great things back home. Um, I think that, that that brings up the next um, topic. Um, every Gambian, um, African for that matter, needs to look at what can we do to better our people, to better our continent. Um, I don't know the answers, but all I know is that we all have to get involved somehow, some way. Um, find a way to get involved. Find a way to share the information. Uh, we cannot afford um, to lose um, our younger generation. 1,500 um, um, Africans um, died since the beginning of this year. Small Gambia, 14% uh, of those that are taking this um, back route are Gambians. Um, what can we do about this? Because obviously our leaders uh, are not comfortable talking about it. Uh, the responsibility comes down to us citizens. And some of us um, that are especially in the West, that can do a little bit. Um, social media uh, to sensitize the young. And also just keep talking to them. Um, the folks in Basse, my hometown, uh, we've taken a hard hit on this route. Um, I've lost a cousin also on this route. And um, so it's very close to home. And, uh, but what can we do other than give information? Talk to the younger generation. Talk to your brothers and sisters, your cousins, nephews, and nieces. Let them understand. Find a way to work with them. Help them get through school. Help them um, go through some kind of uh, vocational center to be able to you know, um, you know, get a career. Um, that is all we can do right now. And put the pressure on our people um, to be able to um, you know, communicate to us um, some of the things that we can do for them. Um, build up organizations to hopefully create jobs. We can do it. Many of us in the West here are helping run multi-million dollar corporations and companies. Uh, why can't we put that um, brain trust together and uh, hopefully um, you know, help one another and help develop our nation? Uh, and, and, and most importantly, we, we've got to help hold our um, governments um, responsible. Um, they're not talking about this matter. And those of us, especially back home, um, the youth, um, need to hold the government responsible, your local governments. Um, you know, engage them, engage your governors, your um, house, house of representatives and, uh, and the like. And, um, you know, join your um, youth organizations. Don't join your organizations that are trying to help your um, towns and your communities. That's the only way forward. Let us know what you need and let's create that job that is uh, needed so that you can be able to uh, make good decisions and be able to earn a great living. Uh, we're not saying no to Europe. We're saying no to the back way to Europe. If you get a visa to fly into Europe, you come in, we will help you um, get settled. But please do not take the back way to Europe. It is not worth your life. Thank you so much.